Uh, my experience in South by so far is just a, is a lot of work. I've been here before and it was similar, and um, I'm hoping tonight I can get out and see some music. You know, I haven't even seen the full roster. I, I, each time I've looked, it's been a little confusing, but maybe when we're done talking, you can tell me where to go. Uh, it seems like it's expanded quite a bit, obviously, but I like it. I think there's a nice, uh, it's a nice concentrated amount of people that are all enthusiastic about music, and uh, there's a very positive energy that I see and feel from everybody on, on the, the end that I'm on of playing music and the people like yourself that I get to talk to. It, it seems very genuine and a lot of enthusiasm. Well, I don't want to date myself, but I do remember when, I do remember when the term came up and what it meant. I, I think it was short for independent of popular things. Um, I don't know. It seems like that's a really wide uh, description now of bands. and um, It seems like a lot of people like to call themselves indie. Uh, well, I don't know. I think it's probably a mentality. I think a lot of people that are, are doing that, I don't know that it's... It's only about the music. I think it's about the way they take charge of their own careers and don't really, uh, at least many of them don't appear to want to be a part of the larger picture um, with record companies and all that. And, and uh, what, you know, when done usefully, it's fantastic, you know, to have all the power for yourself and not be swayed by the, uh, the adult or the older people suggesting what you might be doing. I have a new record called Women in Country that I recorded in Los Angeles uh, with my friend T-Bone Burnett, who he and I have worked together before. And we always wanted to work together again. And uh, it took a little while, but we got to. And um, I recommend it to everybody who has the opportunity to work with T-Bone Burnett. Uh, it, it elevates everybody, puts something very special in the room that um, musicians and artists uh, while it may be intangible exactly what it is, there's something he puts in there that, uh, without question, brings out something very special in everybody. Well, seeing things was, was basically acoustic, and that was, that was the idea from the inception, was to do something very, uh, very sparse and restricted, and, you know, maybe, maybe partly a reaction to being in, in a rock group for so long. Uh, I just wanted to... to maybe give my ears a rest and, and just worry about writing songs. And, and I think in uh, having done it many times, being a little, uh, a little frustrated with yet again trying to find a new sound and a new situation for us to be in. So I thought that it would be the right time to just make a record that was not really about the studio atmosphere and instrumentation, just really only about songs. And I did it. Uh, it's something I wanted to do for a long time. I never suggested that that was anything I would continue to do. Um, but this record is quite different. It's, uh, it's very full, very lush. It's a very large sounding record with the instrumentation. And uh, it's a beautiful sounding record. I mean, I say that because, uh, you know, T-Bone has crafted such a, a sound and environment through the bands, he, through the, the artists, the musicians that he works with. Uh, that really does something really cool, and, and, and it is a huge sound, and it is, it is unique and special. I think it translates pretty well live, you know, but it, it takes a little while. Once you have a new, you know, you have a new batch of songs, a new record, uh, you know, originally you, th you think, I think when you start that you're trying to replicate the sound of records, but you learn very quickly that, uh, you know, what works in the studio doesn't always work at a show, and they adjust, they evolve, and they settle in. Wildflowers are, we're together, you know, we're just waiting for an opportunity where we can all get together and, uh, you know, collectively feel something very purposeful and, and uh, you know, been, having been in the group for a long time, I think we all want to feel like it's, it's exciting and it's worthwhile and to just get back on the treadmill and make record after record. Uh, we did that for a long time and, and you know, we're, everyone's kind of spread out and doing different things now and it's a long time later, people need that.